which hundreds of residents across Chicago and the surrounding cities are still without power this morning after last night's storms. As of right now, ComEd says there are still about 25 active outages, and those outages are affecting a little less than a thousand ComEd customers. The majority of those outages have been reported right here in Cook County, followed by Lake and Will counties. The company says it has crews right now out working on repairs, trying to get power back up and running for everybody. And we do know that there were tornadoes reported on the ground out in the western suburbs. Joni is on the road heading to where residents are waking up to some severe damage. Good morning, Joni. Tell us where you are. Good morning. We're in Geneva seeing the power of that storm and also uh, the power outages and these cold, cold temperatures and the wind. This is everything that February is supposed to be, except with more, including this damage here. Something drilled down here in this neighborhood in Geneva. We are right near Del Nor, uh, Northwestern, the hospital uh, just off Randall Road. I got to be careful because it really is dark out here without any lights and there's still some debris in the streets. But you can see the trees that have come down. These are the backs of houses, so there's a fence here. That's the backyard. And then you can see where the fence gets knocked down over here. Uh, and there's a separation. And then all of these trees. Up uh, high, you can see where the trees got snapped off, apparently, uh, on this street. Um, they, there were reported tornadoes in Batavia and Geneva, though I don't know if this was the result of a tornado. But this street and then the street around the corner, Pepper Valley Lane, this is Cambridge, they both have this kind of damage. Now, we can see that the house lights are on in one of those houses so it looks like they do have some power they're able to stay in there but with other uh, houses that have severe damage of big trees landing on them that would be difficult today they were able to clean up a lot last night while it was still kind of warm out but now we're looking at these winter like temperatures the winds and so cleanup will be a little more difficult in batavia the homeowners talked about what they experienced looks like three or four blocks narrow path we have some significant damage to some of the homes, broken windows, downed trees, uh, some doors blown off, interior, mm -hmm. uh, a lot of uprooted, very large trees in the, in the front yards and the backyards. All around this backyard, you can just see wood everywhere. The trees that have broken. There are very tall trees on the street. Um, and now all of them seem to be lying on the ground. They have a lot to clean up here. This is just one street. I've seen this kind of damage on several streets in this neighborhood. Reporting live in Geneva, I'm Joni Lum. Back to you. All right, Joni.